Let's go to Victoria. Some shambles down there with the new Jacinta Allen-led government. Uh, not even a week in now. But yesterday, of course, we saw the Treasurer Tim Pallas announce he'll introduce legislation to tax all, all vacant residential land across Victoria. Previously, it was only a couple of inner city suburban areas of Melbourne. Now it's across the state. Only we find out the new Premier's office, they say they were blindsided by the move. Um, Pallas has responded, Sophie, saying Alan was aware of his plans, but then he hid out from the media, didn't take questions or respond to them either. This is a shocking tax, but not a good start for the Premier either. Peter, this is a very bad look uh, when Jacinta Allen's only been running the state for less than a week and there's already disarray with who's saying what and who's making what announcement. So very bad look for her. But, I mean, they've got to put these taxes in because they're trying to uh, pay back all this debt we've got. But who suffers? And, Peter, it's obviously the Victorian taxpayers. Now, I'm going to come back to you on this one, Sophie, because you're the Victorian here. Trade Minister Don Farrell, this is the Federal Trade Minister. Well, he was at the AFL Grand Final on the weekend, along with it, a lot of other MPs and corporates. And according to AFL legend Dermy Brereton, who was there signing autographs and, and taking selfies with, with the fans who were lining up, Don Farrell walked up to him, and this is I'm quoting Dermy here, walked up to him, pushed to the front of the queue, and then said to Brereton, and I quote, you have to have a photo with me. Here's Dermy. And a, a, a shortish gentleman, well-dressed, <laughs> sort of walked <laughs> past them and put his arm around my waist, turned to his wife and, and, and said out loud to me, um, I'm a minister of um, trade and tourism. You have to take a photo with me. And I said, well, that's great. I, I'm happy to take it, even though I didn't vote for you guys. <laughs> and then he turned around to me and said, well, you will next time. And, and I said, well, if you do the same to this state as, um, uh, um, as, as the last bloke who was running this state at, at, the, uh, at the local level, mm. um, <laughs> I said, there's no way I'll be voting for you. He said, no, you will, you will. This stuff is cringeworthy, Sophie, but uh, good on Dermy for calling out the way Andrews ran the state into the ground. Oh, look, the Victorian Liberals should be, should be circling Peter around Dermy Brereton. Points to him for actually putting him back in his place. I mean, this is a shocking look again for a politician just waltzing up and thinking they own the place. Not a good look at all.